Oh, it's real. It's real close. It's real close. We're at seven. Are you ready? I need you to get ready. Oh, you should have saw the deck we had yesterday. We had a Vraska, a Foil Vraska, a Doom Whisperer, mm -hmm. a Charnel Troll, mm -hmm. a Gruesome Menagerie, which is pretty good. Mm -hmm. That's not... That doesn't do anything for you? No. That uh, sucks. Your draft's terrible. Oh, we did only go 2-1, unfortunately. Really? Yeah. Hmm. What do we got here? A Rick Rick's Factor. This is a Rick's Factor. <clears throat> Party Mike is in the house tonight. I'm Risk Factor Rick. <laughs> that's actually, that's good. That's a good meme. Is that the pick? Boop. Did you say boop? Mm -hmm. What is, why did you, what is the boop? Mm. Sometimes you just got to boop, I guess. Sometimes you got to be booping. It's probably Rick's Factor. This card's very good. Really? Why, why would you, Why? I mean, they just take four. And then they take four again. That's oh, eight damage in one card. That's true. You ever play you ever play Lava Axe? <clears throat> no. It's like two Lava Axes in one. <clears throat> I roll for you. What happens to Wet Hammer with a British accent? What happens to a Wet Hammer with a British accent goes into... I, you know, I don't know. You know, you're going to have to let me. You're going to have to tell me. I don't know what the pick is here. It's probably going to be something, is it? Could be Bodyguard to keep us open, but... These are both very good. This is good. This guy's good. This pack's not very good outside of the red cards. The red cards are the best cards in this pack. I might just take this guy to stay open. What is his spiel? Can't attack or block alone? Okay. Yeah, I'm going to take this guy. Because we don't have any reason to be blue. Well, see, oh, oh, now it's Scarlet Legionnaire or City Watch Sphinx. All right, man. Important pick here. Well, there was some other if you pick wrong, cards. It's hammer time. Oh, is it? No, there's also Boros in the pack. Oh, okay. I think it's the Sphinx. Yeah? Yeah. Unless you think Boros is just so good, it's better. No, I don't. <clears throat> And there's like nothing in this pack. I guess we can take this this Jorblin. You don't want to take the bounce spell? I don't care about that. I want two drops. That is a two drop. This is not a two drop. This is a two casting cost spell. This is a two drop. You drop him on the board. Drops, 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 drops. We can Dragonauts whatever we want. Oh, see, now we get True Fire Captain and Suntail Hawk. You done messed up, Air Aaron. I mess up. You can still just take that. It's yeah, but then pick. yeah, but then we missed a Skyfire Sky Knight Legionnaire, which is very very good. Well, we got three more packs. Don't worry about it. Two more packs. This feels good actually. This is a nice soothing hammer massage on my skull. Just do one of these, and it'll make it even better. Do which one? Oh, like a little little tapperino? Yeah, just a little tap. Is it Hawk or is it True Fire Captain? You think? I think it's definitely True Fire Captain if we're going Boros. Is it? Yeah, you can get another Hawk. You gotta get another one of those guys. Yeah, but hawks are real good. You crazy. Alright, I'm gonna take the true fire captain. Now there's a sinister sabotage? What is even happening? It's so weird that the guy that retries gates to get double strike is Boros, because like Boros never wants gates. Right, it's, it's so really weird. weird. Yeah. Could take this barging sergeant. He will always... Uh, he always sarge and he will always barge. Always be barging and always be sergeant. My brain. This is so weird, man. You gotta stop. It's kind of like a massage. It's like a hammer massage. That's a real thing, right? Hammer massage in the house tonight. <clears throat> oh, look at that. We're getting past the, the goodness. Also, there's a Night Veil Sprite in here, so we could still be Is It, but I think this is a good signal, so. Whereas this is just a blue guy. Mmm, Boar's fine. Alright, I'm gonna put this guy over here, but if we get some Is It Guild Gates, I'll just play it. What the hell? That's a. Probably not in our Boros deck, though. It's a six mana guy.
How you doing, man? <laughs> no idea what you're doing right now. Opening my eyes. Were they closed? No. I was opening them. I was enha- enhancing opening them. Stupid jaw. What's going on, buddy? You were enhancing opening them? Yeah. I Drafted was... some Dominaria and played against a deck that had Karn and Teferi. Wow, that does not seem... That seems like some shenanigans. What were you saying about your eyes? I was enhancing them. Are they enhanced now? Yeah. Are you like a cyborg now? Yeah. Huh. Ye. 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 Thank you. Oh, thank you. Evil Monkey, thank you so much for the sub. Welcome back. Really appreciate it. <clears throat> What's the what's the hold up here? Did Magic Online crash and we just don't know about it? It's not a it's a fair guess. It's a wonderful, unique hammer that is currently just in front. Wow, I didn't know that was a command. That's something. Oh, a sure strike. That's a top tier pick, my friend. Oh, Skyline Scout. All right, now we're talking. Can that Sky Sky Knight Legionnaire come back because no one wants to be Boros? That's the only pick I regret right now because it's, it was such a good one. And Mike messed up real bad. He suggested that we take the the Sphinx. And uh, this is this is why he's uh, going to be sleeping outside yeah, tonight. How we knock out the, the Boros captain and stuff. Sleeping outside. Mike is going to be on the front lawn tonight. Sleepless in Clearwater. Yeah. Clearwater. Clearwater. Ah, that is the only card we'll even remotely consider here. And we'll consider none of these. All right. So I think we're done here. Oh, look, we got the we got the little sergeant. So many sergeants in this format. Barging sergeant, garrison sergeant. They, like, promote everybody on Ravnica. <clears throat> I guess this guy's a captain. Hey, man, I could I could cosplay this guy right now. I don't think you could. That's I don't. That's you sad to be that taller. You, <laughs> you know how tall I am. Ooh, March of the Multitudes. <clears throat> Is that bad boy worth it? Uh, yeah, it's like four tickets. I'm definitely taking that thing. This is also easy to splash too, because you get you get the Gruel lands and you get the Celestial lands. Yeah, for one green, this is definitely worth it. Also, if we get enough Vernati shield mates, we can just splash it off that because it's got Convoke. But there's really nothing else even in this pack, so... We could take Murmuring Mystic, but March is just a solid playable card. Oh, wow, and Amara? Jesus. Amara Jesus. <laughs> it's Amara Jesus. I think we're going to be like... What if we just take this and we just go Naya mid-range? Mm. You don't like that? No, because, like, three colors never works out. It works out tons of times. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. You don't know because you're never here. I took it anyway because I only well, like... I have to go to work, Frank. God. Well, everyone... Dude, I fuck, it's funny you say that because every, every day people are like, Hey, where's Mike? Where's Mike today? And I'm like, he has a job. He's literally at his job. <laughs> like, they just... I don't know. It's weird. They, like, don't think you do anything other than, like, show up on the stream randomly. And if you're not here... They have no idea what you could possibly be doing. <coughs> I took the Rock Charger. <sighs> Hopefully the Celestia Guild Gate comes back, but... Uh... Oh, there you go. Here we go. See, even if we don't play these, though, I'm totally fine with it. But they're very, very good. And then we get this Sky, Sky Knight Legionnaire. This is my Halloween costume. I'm MC Hammer. It's Hammer time. All day. Wow, you put a lot of effort into this costume. Yeah, I know it. Mike isn't your imagination. If he was, you wouldn't be able to see him, would you? Oh, with Sacred Foundry? Maybe you all have the same imaginary visions. Wow, all of us? That would be pretty mm -hmm. amazing, actually. I would be impressed. I'm going to take the Sacred Foundry. It's good fixing that doesn't come into play untapped. Ben Stark actually took the Sacred Foundry as well when he was drafting. And uh, he made a good point that uh, Boros does want lands that that like dual lands but they don't they don't want them to come to play tapped obviously because you want your curve to be very very good so now we have a crater maker or a luminous bonds i think it's actually luminous bonds yeah 
I do like a crater maker though. I think Luna's gotta make that bread. How did we make? How did we make the bread? Bomb removal. Uh, oh, bread. Yeah. Bombs removal evasion. That's the A. I forget. What's the D? Dirtle. Oh, dirtles. Oh, true fire captain number two. Yep, I'll take that. Swath cutter giant. It's not really a card I want to put in this deck. I think it's probably just blade instructor or take heart. Oh, aggro, dirt, and duders. <laughs> there you go. You guys nailed it. I figure it worked like that new battle bond set where once you two are on the battlefield, we can see Mike. Yeah, as, as long as I'm on the battlefield, Mike is here as well. What's the pick, man? I'm going to take the Blade Instructor. Get okay. Wrecked. It's because you didn't speak up, man. It's your fault. This pack's not good. You're not good. Got him. You sound like my mom. Wow. Sorry. Jeez. Eh, whatever. Two drops a two drop. Just came into the stream and I can see Mike has been misbehaving. <laughs> yeah. It's been... It's been less than ideal. Oh, Slesnia Guildgate. Alright. Slesnia Gizzlegate. A Gizzlegate. Should have known there'd be a hammer command, but I doubted. Yeah, well. Get wrecked. Don't say Gizzlegate. That's weird. Why? Because you're weird. Tell me what's wrong with the Gizzlegate. This guy's just fine. So whenever you play a red spell? Yeah. Okay. He's usually just a 2-2. I mean, like, not usually, but, like, he's probably immediately a 2-2, and then he's very easily a 4-4. Four -four. Hey, man, what's a bober? Sober Scrober. <laughs> Everybody knows that. What's the Scrober, man? Bober Dad. <laughs> God. <clears throat> we could take this Experimental Frenzy. We could yep. also take Legionnaire or Gird for Battle. Yeah, I like picking the better cards more. You don't think this card's good? No. Oh my god. It's too dirty. <sighs> Is it just Sky Knight Legionnaire? Frenzy is awesome and Boros Frenzy. Frenzy. Maybe it is good. Let's try it out. Why not? All right, we're gonna try out the frenzy. <clears throat> Probably want a two drop here. This card is strong removal. This is strong removal. This is strong removal. If you're in, if we were in Sultai, we'd have a great time here. Now instead, we gotta take this ornery goblin, which I actually think is just fine. This pack is also hot trash. Hot trash, get your hot trash. Get your hot trash here. Matthew Ori, I saw that picture of you with your, with your beard shaved. I can't approve, man. As a bearded man myself. Look, another dead weight? Jesus. These are ridiculous. I guess it's just maniacal rage. But then we can't block. Yeah, I don't know if you know this, but you're really not blocking that much in the Boros deck. Is that so? That's a true story. Um, I regret my decisions in life. He'll grow back. Stormcrow, welcome back, buddy. Uh, it will grow back. He's right about that. That's not. That's not wrong. Whatever. I'll take one of this guy. I don't think we're playing a second maniacal rage. Riot or Riot? Riot's not very good. Unless you're talking about Quiet Riot, in which case... Come on, feel the noise. Michael, rock ya, boys. We'll get a wild, wild, wild... That's Quiet Riot, in case you guys didn't know. Silent. He's thinking of an opposite word of Riot. Silent. 
Go on. Silent safety. <clears throat> you think silent safety is the opposite of quiet riot? Wait. Loud safety. Yeah, I was like, wait, quiet and silent are the same. I was actually originally trying to make it like something that was also quiet riot. Like oh. A like cinnamon. And then I threw you off. Yeah, and I wasn't prepared. And he's like, oh, wait, am I doing the opposites here? Dang it. See how I got into his head. Oh, my God. Woo, that's a good boy. Come on back. Wow, this dead weight should not be here, so I'm just going to take it because you don't deserve that's it. That's a good boy. This is also a good boy. No, he's a danger doggo. Your mother's a danger doggo. <laughs> Got him. Is she? You know, man, I don't know. Okay? Probably, okay? Okay. We need one more card. No. Really? No. Really? We do have two Selenia Guildgates. I know, that's why I'm saying it. Could just be Hammer Dropper. I'm never impressed by Hammer Dropper. I just sneezed real hard and I think my eyeballs popped out. I hope you put them back in. Put your eyeballs back in. Put your eyeballs back in your brain. Do you think your eyeballs go in your brain? What about Caller the Council or whatever? Caller the Council. <laughs> That's close. You know what, man? I'm going to be honest with you. It was not that close. We don't have anything with four toughness. What's the problem is? The problem with playing this is that we do have to play the guild gates. I think I just want the hammer dropper in here. Oh, I'm a dropper. Keep on rolling. I'm Mr. Zippy Moon. Won't you keep on shining on me? Yeah, let's see if this works. This seems good. My eye is itching. So I'm gonna scratch it. We did it. Eye has been successfully scratched. You better be ready because we're we're getting there. We're in it. We're in it to win it, Michael. I'm gonna keep this. If we hit a white, we get to go turn three bodyguard into turn four skylight skylight Nijinair. Uh oh. Big fan alert. <laughs> oh great. We can also draw ornery goblin into planes. I'll take that as well. Okay, a white card was not what we're looking for here. All right, there's still time. We still have two more turns. Well, actually, we have one more turn to draw a land. Two more turns to draw a white land. Oh, we're so good at this game. Hey. Hey, that's pretty good. Now I feel like we're okay. I feel like it's all okay. I don't think they can actually deal with this guy now. Oh, biscuits. Could just trade and make it 3 3. That seems good. Could also just wait a turn. Maybe like demotion this guy. Keep this guy alive. That seems better. 
Because any land, uh, any any white land, I guess, <laughs> which we have eight, I guess. We have seven seven planes and a sacred foundry left. Let's just cast this and this. Which is pretty good. Pretty, 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 pretty good. What's going on, Denmark? No, oh, oh well, that's worse. <laughs> that's, oh, that's better. Hmm. Hmm. So we can demotion one of them. Attack with both. We don't even need to do that, though. Right, but like next turn, we're going to want to do it too, right? Because like we want to take care of the other blocker. One of double blocks and gets wrecked. I don't think they have any reason to do that. But. Might as well. That'd be pretty sick, I guess. I don't think they're ever double blocking into uh, three open mana, though. If they think we have take heart, they might double block. Yeah, I, don't, I didn't foresee them ever double blocking there. See, because if we put this on here, I guess we can wait. They didn't double block. You okay? I don't think you're dying. I'm always dying. That's really unfortunate, man. We're all always dying, Frank. I'm good. I'm alive. To be alive is to be dying. Oh, this is... Well, that's unfortunate that you would do that. See, now I want the extra land so I can put it on here and attack with both these guys again. This is why I want to do it last turn, but if they played another guy, you know, the plan is... I guess we're just going to hope we draw a white mana right at the top. Planes one time. That's not the one. Thanks for nothing. Yeah. I guess you just play the Legionnaire and attack for two. And I'm tempted to just attack for three. Then we just put them to... Like, we'll get this guy off the board. I think that's fine. We have Barging Sergeant in hand. We no longer have any creatures that can actually mentor onto, so I think this is fine. When you get the t-shirt thing up and running, you should also sell hammers. I would buy one with a big fan, though. Wow. Ow. I hit my little foot. Ow. Oh. Oh. Really? Is this how you're going to be? I guess so. See, now they have to deal with this guy. Okay, I guess they found a way. I need the hot bean juice. I need the hot bean juice. That just sounds perverse, man. Give me that hot bean juice. I hear you like mountains. I got you these mountains so you can... Man, if they didn't kill that last guy, we would have had a 4-4 four, four and a 4-4 four, a four, four flyer, no less. If we played this guy on their guy, we would have had a totally different game. Because we could have sacked the bodyguard. This is actually not bad because we can demotion this guy. And we're going to draw three from... I know. We're going to risk factor first because they might take four thinking they can block. And then we just demotion. Demotion in the ocean. Look. Look how good this is. I'm looking. Look with your special eyes. Human bean juice. Sugar water. That's from... Uh, this is a decision. Men that... in black? Correct. Men in black. Here comes the men in black. 
So we just have another one in the graveyard. Like we can see, like we just get to do it again. We just get to draw six cards, man. It's pretty good. Also, if they play a dude, we demote it. Oh, that's really sad. Oh, I'm having a bad time now. Wow. Well, that turn, that changed things pretty quickly. Yeah, they gained a lot of life. They sure did. I'm not going to play one dude. Actually, I might just put Maniacal Rage on this guy. We're not going to block with him. And they have to have a removal spell. And this guy's a 7-4. And it's just... Puts us out of range of dead weight. But I'm pretty sure they're just going to... Yeah. Oh my god. This is unreal. <laughs> I'm like having a... I'm having a real good time right now. You don't seem like it. That's true. That's what I meant. Wow, after the risk factor and the other dude, I really have no idea how this game is going the way it is. Guess we're going to two here. One, two, three. This is five. Not ideal. Amazing. Absolutely incredible draws. Severed Strand and a Deadly Visit into Rhizome Lurcher into F. Affectionate Indrick. That's just incredible. Definitely bring in Collar the Culprit. Seems good. <laughs> Seems good. I suggested it be in your main deck. Did you? Yeah. Good for you. I suggested it being in your main deck. Uh, I'm not going to really... Like, I should theoretically be the more aggressive deck, so I'm not super high on putting a Restore or a 6-mana creature in our deck. That doesn't profitably, profitably block with any of theirs. I feel like we almost had that. And then we didn't. I'm going to go make some coffee now. Okay, I'll see you later. Yep, this is a good hand. <clears throat> we'll keep it. Here come my... No audio today, I forgot my headphones, but I'm looking forward to... Oh, geez, are glad to hear it. Well, we can actually, we have perfect mana here, so that's nice. How has Rage performed? It's fine. It's definitely fine as like a one of. 
you put it on your mentor guys, lets you get extra mentor triggers out of them. Um, on a turn where they have no good blocks, it lets you push their extra damage. If you can put it on like a Sky Knight Legionary, you're in good shape. Like here, I'd be tempted to put it on the Ornery Goblin. But instead, we're just going to play this attack with the Sky Knight Legionnaire. And next turn, we can mentor onto the Ornery Goblin to make sure we can get through the stray. Vernadi. See, that's worse because now we can't mentor, but... We can actually play both of these, put the Maniacal Rage on this guy. That is interesting. It might just be these two. The problem with Maniacal Raging onto like an Ornery Goblin is that... Uh, Is that it won't get you can't mentor onto it. And they can still just block with these two and kill it. If we mentor onto it, make to a three two, it just trades with the shield mate, which is not great. If we put on the captain, they could still triple block it. Which means they take five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I also don't like that they have an, a, a bigger incentive to kill this with like something like um, with something like Deadly Visit. Whereas right now we can disincentivize that by putting it on someone else. The problem with, like I said, the problem with putting it on here is that they can just deadly visit, which we saw two of next turn. So I'm not super high on that. I'd almost rather just play Charger this turn. I agree, the Arena Draft was a long video. It's because there's seven rounds. We're actually going to put it on here. If you want to double block, it's fine. Gets two guys off the board. We have a 3-3 flyer and a 4-3. Like, all this is okay. Like, if you don't double block here, then you're double blocking here. So you can only... You have to commit two to either one of these, which is nice. Again, I didn't want to put a Rage on here because it just makes it a 4-4. Whereas if we mentor onto it, it's a 3-3 right now. So, I mean, it's basically just one power and toughness less but you get to diversify your threats both of these are great targets if you put it once you put a maniacal rage on either of these they're super easy to kill with a deadly visit because it's just such good value for you and also this would be another blowout if we had any combat trick here so Or if this guy had trample. So I assume you're going to deadly visit on true fire captain, which is fine. Who is your daddy and what does he do? I'm a cop, you idiot. If we can draw a demotion or a take heart. I think we have take heart in the deck. I actually don't even know. 
I think we'd be in good shape. Hitchclaw Recluse. This is nice because they're almost forced into... Uh, They're almost forced into taking, to giving us cards. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, that'll do. All right, that's pretty good. Could have played this and then floated this guy. Yeah, that's pretty good. Man, Mitch Claw Recluse is right. Here comes the Mitch in black. I'll keep this. This is actually a pretty good hand. We do need another red source. Oh, here he comes. Here comes old Mitchy. I'll continue on YouTube tomorrow. Thanks for the... Cerisi? I, I can, I'm trying to figure out how to press your name. Either way, thanks so much, buddy. Appreciate it. I'll see you later, I'm sure. I think we just block here. The problem is that this guy is always going to be able to block, so... What can you do? The scene where he's playing a little guitar and just like, what are you guys talking about? How's your coffee? Pretty good. You haven't even tried it yet, you liar. I took a sip out there, buddy, okay? I took a sip out there, all right. I did. Well, even if we don't hit a land here, we can still play Maniacal Rage and Legion Guild Mage, which is pretty good. You like that? You like Hold that? Oh, check the stream. Did I mess up? No, we're good. Did you mess up? I thought I pulled the screen or something. Someone said I messed up with Fragger of Time. Uh, I think that's because you moved it. Hitchclaw Recluse. Oh, that's a good one, but I'm missing red mana real bad. <sighs> red mana here would have been a game changer. Oh, actually, we can't do both these things. We don't have a double red. I'm not smart. Well, this is pretty rough. Everything in our hand needs multiple red sources. Yep. I guess you just hope we don't have a second black. Get in there for a bunch. And no whammies. I think they... Wow, they just went to combat, so maybe there are no whammies happening. Come on, no whammies. Perhaps the whammies have slowed down. Oh, that's good. That's not a whammy at all. Uh-oh, Sever Strands. Yeah. To the surprise of no one. Great. 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 Just this guy, huh? No, both? All right. We'll definitely block here. Because next turn, that becomes a 4-4 four, four that we can't really deal with. And we're not going to actually win this game unless we... Yep, that's a good dude. Yep, that's a dead dude. Hope you don't have another one. Because then they just get worse. They help each other. Sure. Huh. Well, that's good, I guess. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, that's pretty good. I 
I just want a second. I just want a mountain. It's neither a mountain nor a card we can cast. Seems good. False. We have 17 lands. Like, we're not... Yeah, we're just dead here. Go to one. Cool. Always a pleasure, Magic Online. I never don't enjoy interacting with your amazing shuffler. Second mountain? Anywhere? There you go. It's okay. It's only 20 cards into the deck. Oh, boy. Good times. Good times. What's up, Kerwit? I feel like if we can just hit a second red there, there's actually no way we, um, we there's no way we lose that match. True Fire Captain, we have Sure Strike. We can play a card and play Sure Strike. We can start emptying our hand to get to Experimental Frenzy. Like, yeah, I don't think you can quantify that Arena has a better Shuffler, unfortunately. Sure. Could we have the one and then play it over the way? What? I have no idea what it... <clears throat> Be more specific. I don't know what that means. Chris of Kent, no worries, buddy. I'll put a deface so it doesn't come across as aggressive. What is my score? <laughs> oh, one. I always think it's funny when people are like, it's just, are you, it's just the actual frame? I'm like, N dude, no one's going to take my actual name. Okay, well, that's a, that's a thing, I guess. Wow, that's aggressive. I think he didn't hit his land drop is my guess. I guess. Missing one land drop doesn't seem like... Uh... I clicked instead of... Inst I clicked play instead of dropping. Oh... Okay, well, there we go. All right. Good good games. This deck is great. I'm crushed. We've basically... We're basically 3-2 right now. We, we've only lost... <laughs> All right, sweet. Good times, guys. Good times. How many hit points do you get? What are you saying, UA loves? What are you saying? Hit points... I can only see his regular cam. That's true. You live in the regular world, not this, not the. This hand seems terrible. You're right. This is much better. You can stay. I'll trust you. I'll trust the second mountain. What could possibly go wrong? My name is Michael, and I sit in a chair. Why? <laughs> Man, we're three for three with the with the name compliments here. He's like, hey, I watched your stream a few times. It sucked. Oh, that's mean. Mountain? Jackal. Was it Jackal? I Oh, we knew what it was gonna be. Never mind. I'm a I'm a dummy. <laughs> wow. What do you say? Here, I'll I'll tune in real quick for viewer count. <laughs> That's messed up, man. Is Mike bald? Do you have eyeballs? What about me looks bald, man? He's got hair. He grew it himself. I did. He's very proud of it, too. 
every day he talks about it he's like look at all this hair i grew myself it's really weird but uh, you know it's uh, he he's a grown boy so he gets proud of weird things wow okay well here we go it's that time again where we don't get to hit our land don't get to hit our land it's your boy Pelty. Yeah, this guy's... Alright, well, they don't have a bigger creature to play, I guess, because they attacked with Pelty, so... I don't think we're winning this race. Hmm. Mountain? Yeah, didn't think so. Yep, not having a second, a third, fourth land here again is pretty, pretty rough. Two matches out of three. Having a good time. So we take six. Or we take eight if they crack back. But we're dealing six. And there's no real... I guess if they go all in and we attack with this guy. Still doesn't do much though. They just block it, right? Shut up and take my money. Has your hair been stolen by the hair gremlin? Get all the hair you need from Mike B's homegrown hair. It'll bober your scrober. I don't wow. think those verbs. I don't think those words work the way that that you just said that they work. This is awkward for everybody. I don't know what to do here, because none of our options are great. And your option is to die. Well, that's unfortunate. Sure. Sure. Oh, they didn't attack at all? No, this is good for us. That's not a red mana. So we go block, block. We take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Something's happening here. They're going to play Flourish, and then we're just going to die. Okay, this is not Flourish. Okay, that's fine. Ain't nothing going to care about that. Oh, no. I got to keep on moving. Ain't nothing going to rid my that. Ain't nothing gonna hold me down. Oh no. Mike B isn't me. Hmm. Yeah, you heard me. I did. I don't see any benefit to it not blocking here because you don't have any way to really push through anything. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten if they pump. So you actually have to block here. I think we're dead. We're not dead yet. Boros don't like being on the back foot. We're not on the back foot. I think we are. We block here. And we take four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. They go to one. Then we attack for seven. If they don't have a pump. And if they even if they do have a pump, they actually have to they can't pump this. Okay, now they can if their last card is a take heart. Yeah, if they don't have an answer for this, we just kill them. Which means they probably do. Okay. Yep. Lucky, 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 lucky. I can't. I can't. Unbelievable. Oh my god. I mean, it's uncommon, so. That's a good one. Uh, 
Mike was lethal without the land and take heart gets the matter. Yeah, sure. Uh, cool, cool story, I guess. I don't know. A lot of cards get us uh, two, two cards. <laughs> One of them is an uncommon. <laughs> like, uh, I don't understand. Like, it's really not that many. They have one card in hand. It has to be one of those two cards. Cool. Cool. <sighs> Having a good time. This draft has gone very, very well. Apologies in advance if you're watching on YouTube for the salt, but this is not a uh, this has not been an enjoyable experience when our opponents always seem to have it. And uh... no, on you. Look at that magic trick. I will donate no dollars if you spray the mic in the face so he can he can so he can the talk. What does that even mean? What are you saying right now? So he can the talk. Uh, uh. So he can the talk. Uh, uh. Frenzy would be good. I probably should have played the mountain just in case. Actually, if we hit, eh, it's fine. Yeah, that's pretty good. Interesting that you put it on the guy that can't block. Well, we lost games to Mana Screw, and now it's time to get Mana Flooded. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Die to might again. Sure, let's prevent that, I guess. Yep, pretty sure they're just going to kill us with Might here. This is going to be 7, and then... No, not not dead. Alright. <laughs> this is hilarious. If they didn't have this guy, we'd actually win again. Like, it's 3, 4, 5, 6, and then the 4th counter would have been 7 exactly. Maybe you won't block. Yeah, I'm sure that's what's going to happen. One, did you receive your humorous hat book? I definitely did receive my humorous hat. I wouldn't call it a hat per se, but it is. Uh, it has been received. Yep. And dead. All right, a sweet one-two where the match we actually won did not even count. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully this was not uh, too long for you because it was definitely too long for me. Feel free to check me out on Twitch and Patreon if you guys want to support the stream in any way. And you can check out MeUndies.com slash Frank Lepore. You'll get 15% off your first order. You also get free shipping and free returns. And it's just another way you can support the stream. So feel free to slam those like and subscribe buttons. Um, 
I wouldn't personally, because this was not one of the better experiences I've had playing Magic the Gathering, but that's up to you. Either way, I appreciate it. Thanks for watching.